Welcome to Niger Uncle News. In today's news, anxiety as CBN sacks boards of Union, Keystone, and Polaris banks. Decision taken after marathon meeting of COG or Bazet team. Tinibu grants accelerated approval for dissolution. Apex Bank to announce interim management boards today. The federal government has taken over three commercial banks, Union, Polaris and Keystone, following the dissolution of their management and boards by the Central Bank of Nigeria yesterday. In a statement signed by the Acting Director of Corporate Commissions, Hakama Sidi Ali, the bank said the action became necessary due to non-compliance of these banks and their respective boards with provisions of Section 12C, F, G and H of Banks and Other Financial Institutions Act 2020. The bank's infractions vary from regulatory non-compliance, corporate governance failure, disregarding the conditions under which their licenses were granted, and involvement in activities that pose a threat to the financial stability, among others, the Apex Bank said. The CBN is expected to communicate the decision to the banks today while interim management and boards are expected to be announced straight away to prevent a vacuum in the system. A source said the list were being finalized last night. The banks, according to a report of Jim Obaze, the special investigator appointed to probe the Apex Bank, were allegedly acquired by or through the connivance of the former governor of the regulatory body, Godwin Emefieli. But some sources, private to the processes leading to the decision, said the action was taken in the best interest of the industry and that it would put pay to speculation on the future of the affected banks, reposition them and restore corporate governance, which had been totally eroded. Obazi and his team were also at the meeting. The central bank was said to have gone the extra mile in securing the approval of the president, Bola Tinibu, even though it has the power under Bofia to dissolve the management or board of any financial institutions where there is corporate governance failure. The request, it was informed, was granted speedily by the president yesterday before the meeting ended at 5 p.m. Thank you for being a part of Niger Uncle News today. Join us again soon for more. Stay informed, stay connected.